Hi everybody, Andrew Blue Moon here, coming to you this Friday to bring you a wonderful episode of Witches for Wellness. You can look forward to seeing me um, about this time every Friday for a long time. So let's get started, eh? I suppose I should begin by introducing myself a little bit because I think a lot of you do not know who I am. Um, well, I'm Andrew Blue Moon, and um, I'm 20 years old and currently working with my uh, parents at a family business. We sell children's clothing online, so that's exciting. And um, I work there full-time. Don't go to school or anything like that, but I do spend a whole lot of time reading and uh, researching things and learning about um, natural healing, as in like aromatherapy or reflexology or vibrational healing, gemstone therapy, um, energy medicine, um, really anything get my hands on. Um, I'm really interested in just about everything, um, and uh, I'm always looking for something to learn and to read, etc. If you'd like to know more, then um, I invite you to my personal channel. Um, there's a lot more you can find out about me there, and um, I'd just like to have you. Anyway, so let's move on to what I'd like to talk to you about this Friday. I would like to talk to you about you. Um, you know, I looked at this channel, which is for wellness, and I was looking at the videos, and I thought, you know, these videos are a little bit hard to watch. Not because they're not good videos, because they're great videos. But what I'm saying is, is that, like, it's a lot of work to do these things, you know, to, to, um, work on yourself, you know, to, uh, eat right, to exercise, things like that. It, it's hard work, and and um, part of the work begins with watching a video to find out about it, you know? And I would like to encourage all of you to check out this stuff, you know? Because there's a lot of great people here, and there's a lot of great videos with a lot of great info. And I would like to encourage you to not just watch these videos, to listen, you know, listen and um, do something about it, you know, because out of anything in the world, the most important and best thing that you can invest in is yourself, you know, and whether that's education or on the most basic level, just feeling good every day, you know, because if you are anything like me, you have a hundred million dreams and goals and and uh, things like that, and you want to get them done, right? Well, you got to feel good to get there. And um, that's where this comes in, you know? You got to be well. And if you spend every day eating fast food and Coca-Cola, chances are you, you know, you might not end up feeling too good most of the time. If you don't get enough sleep, you might not end up feeling good too much, feeling too good most of the time. And if you have, you know, bad thought processes and, um, you know, unhealthy thought patterns going on, then chances are you might not feel too good. So, let me just encourage you to invest in yourself a little bit. Now, you know, it might be difficult, it might make take a few changes, but after you do it for a while, it'll be fine. If you say anything about the 21-day uh, challenge, well, you know, if from my understanding, it's the line of thinking that if you can do it for 21 days, you can do it forever. I believe that because I know somebody who stopped drinking uh, soda for a good long while and she hasn't drank any, drunken any, for three years, okay? To me personally, I'm like, wow, how do you do that? Because I, I like my soda. But to her, it's not a struggle. She doesn't have to fight it. She, like, if she ever takes a sip of it, it's disgusting. She hates it. It's, it tastes gross. Um, for a while, um, I, I, I knew someone who was a vegetarian, and same thing, you know, they, uh, it's not like they struggled not to eat meat, they just, you know, didn't want it. When they ate it, it was kind of, kind of gross, and, you know, when you eat veggies, you don't risk chomping down on some weird, crunchy, mystery substance, and then you're like, oh, what's that? It's so gross. But, anyway, so, um, I guess I'll keep it short for today. 
Um, but I would just love, love, love to encourage you to invest in yourself. I do have one announcement also in the in light of beginning on Witches for Wellness. Um, I was looking at the channel, I was like, and you know, am I really going to get on this channel and be preaching to people about being well when I personally am ignoring my own wellness? When there's things that I know I could be doing and I'm just ignoring them? So no, I guess I can't do that. So um, I've started a blog when my dear friend Melanie and we are going to be um, training for a triathlon which is exciting because I am hardly in any shape and I barely know how to ride a bicycle isn't that exciting but um, the blog details our training and our experiences with it we've got a really nice looking blog it's um, got some good pictures and even some video on there for you. Um, she's a really great writer and it's a lot of fun and I invite you to join us there. And I'll include a link in the sidebar for that. It's called From the Computer Chair to the Finish Line. Hopefully um, that will encourage some of you to do some exercise and stuff and um, just know that I'm right there along with you, okay? So I'm Andrew Blue Moon, and you can expect to see me on Fridays here on Witches for Wellness. And you got to invest in yourself, all right? And I will be right there along with you trying to get, trying to achieve a much higher level of wellness than I currently have. And um, I'd love to hear from you. Uh, please message me if you have any questions or you want to know about me or or maybe you just don't like me and you want to send me a message about that. Um, yeah, so have a wonderful, blessed day and invest in yourself. Remember, it's just one small step at a time. And it's one small decision at a time. So, you know, next time you're at the refrigerator and on one hand you have a Coca-Cola, on the other hand you have like a wonderful glass of orange juice, take the orange juice small decisions you know it doesn't all happen overnight just small decisions so i'll see you later and invest in yourself